Hey, we on. How's everyone doing this afternoon? I am Dupree Shamir, the owner of Social Therapy Magazine. And we got we got a special guest that's coming on. My son, you know, brother is an activist. He's doing major things. His boots is on the ground. And we just want to have a talk with the good brother. And we just want to see, you know, what's going on with him. But while we waiting on my son, I want to let y'all guys know to uh, get the great smelling products, get the great smelling pretty candles at prettycandles.com. We got like Chanel number five. This is Chanel number five right here. Chanel number five. We also have we also have peach mango. Got peach mango. We have like six different scents and we have amber essential. This is a gel product, by the way, too. So we have that. We also have cinnamon apple berry. And these products smells good. It's made by me. And it's really a good smelling product. And we have lavender fresh herbs. And we also have pineapple paradise. So please get the word out there. Follow us at Pretty Candles on Instagram. That's P-R-E-E-T-Y Candles. Uh, and you know Instagram and also follow the website www.prettycandles.com that's p r e e t y so uh, you know just looking forward to having a brother on you know having a talk with the brother and um you know we did the show last night me and softly spoken therapy lounge it was a great show so y'all guys check it out now you can go to the bio you can go to social therapy ig click on the link and listen to the great show we talked about self worth, knowing your self worth. So it was a, it was a definitely it was a great show. So, you know, we just want y'all guys to know to support us. You know, follow follow the movement, follow the show. You know, any donations will be grateful. Uh, shout out to Shamika. Thank you so much for tuning in, Shamika. Hello to you as well. Um, so we we looking to have a lot of great content, a lot of. Um, great topics to discuss with our viewers and listeners. And also down the line, we definitely will be having special guests uh, to join us as well. But Therapy Lounge is a show to help those who might be the voiceless that need a voice to be heard or need some advice. And me and Softly Spoken want to definitely give y'all guys that great therapeutic treatment. So, you know, you know, I'm just glad for y'all guys checking in. And somebody was asking me about uh, Chanel number five. Chanel is like one of our popular candles. Chanel is one of our popular candles. People really love it. This is one of my best selling ones because right now I'm marketing six different scents right now. But if you go to the website, we have over 100 different uh, gel candles and bath crystals as well, you know. And next, like probably in a couple of weeks, we definitely going to have. Um, People can purchase uh, candle kits if they want to start their own franchise, want to be their own owners. We definitely will be uh, having that on a website where you can purchase a, a candle kit, you know, and we definitely uh, looking for people that, that want to be entrepreneurs, want to own their own business. Maybe sometimes just extra revenue stream. You get tired of, uh, you know, you need extra funds. You want to say, well, you know what, you know, I'm working as nine to five and maybe down the line this will help me to start my own business with uh, pretty candles. So we definitely want to, you know, inspire up and coming entrepreneurs and want to come on and purchase a candle kit from us. So we definitely looking forward to that. So, uh, you know, we, we, we got a lot going on, you know, as far as the pretty candles, the website, like I said, we do the bath crystals. We do the, uh, what we doing the shower gels, um, coming in probably a couple of weeks. So we just building, we building the website. So, uh, you know, let me know what you think of that website. You know, just leave a comment. Let me know what you think of it. You can leave me a comment on Pretty Candles on Instagram and also Social Therapy IG. You can definitely do that. So, you know, waiting on my, my guest, my Sean, my son, waiting on him to come on. So, uh, you know, if y'all guys have any questions, you can just comment right now. If you have any questions you want to ask me, you know, I look forward to just, you know, responding back to you. And yeah, donate. And also you can donate to Therapy Lounge. You know, we on Anchor and we on Spotify, whether it's a dollar or whether it's two or five or 10, every bit helps. It's all about empowerment, 
and we need an economic base to so we can start um, hiring more people to come on on board with us. We definitely want to come on board. Um, and that's very important. And I try to explain to everyone that uh, economic base is very important. And once you start um, practicing that, we can build a bigger we can build a bigger bridge where you can you can constantly you can you can create a job and you help others and you have people working together, you know, and, and, and that's important, you know, so, you know, with this pretty candles and the social therapy mag. You know, we're just looking to bring on some more people and people that's, that really believe in a movement. It's not about my whole my whole de um, definition. It's not about hiring people. It's about bringing people on. And it's a movement. We are working together for that common goal, for the common goal to to bring people on and stuff. So that's what I want to do. You know, so, um, yeah. So um, if you have any questions, please feel free to comment right now. I really appreciate it. I mean, your your comments is important to me. It's important. It's important to, you know, the social media to my pages on Social Therapy IG, and also you can follow me on Twitter, Dupree Shot Mayor. You can follow me on there. If you have anything you want to discuss, if you have something you want us to talk about as far as topic, or you have a question that you need that you need resolve a problem that you need to be resolved, and you want us to speak on me and softly spoken to speak on it. Feel free to do that. We come on every Monday at 10 p.m. Every Monday at 10 p.m. on Anchor with Spotify as well. So, you know, you click on the link and you can tune in. So we had a great show last night. Knowing, you know, talking about self-worth, knowing your self-worth. So that was very, that was a very great, uh, great show for session five. So we're looking to have a great show next Monday. So, you know, we just just want y'all guys to, um, you know, want you to tune in and for more content and everything. So I, I got a question I wanted to ask you. Mm. Let's see. Someone is trying to. Wait. Yeah. Hello to you as well. Um, I'm waiting on my shine to come on. So I can't I can't really take anybody's request right now at this point but uh definitely you know I'll, I'll be doing maybe some more i'll be doing some more ig live so we can come in and we can kind of talk and kind of you know conversate and whatever's on your mind whatever you're thinking or you know you know that's what that's what it's about uh, it's about conversating unity and it's all about just networking so you know um anybody has a question they want like to ask me Shout out to Giovanni too. I know you was on here. I'm not sure if you're still on here. Shout out to Giovanni. She's uh that softly spoken daughter. She's definitely she's she's doing a lot. She's I'm a, she's gonna be a marketing a marketing genius, promotion and everything. So just make sure you follow her, Miss Vani two one five. Follow her, you know. So um, yeah, we just we just waiting on our special guest. My son, you know, hopefully he comes on. So, yeah, so, you know, um, I will feel free, you know, if you have any questions, you know. So, you know, I also people was asking me, too, about Social Therapy Mag. They was like, are you going to be doing a, a publication soon? Or what is it with, like, we might just do, like, maybe one seasonal publication because right now, Social media has taken over the whole world as far as publication. You don't see too many people with a physical magazine. Have you seen anybody with a physical magazine? Say yes or no right now to me. Have you seen anybody with a physical magazine now? Um, whether you whether you on on a train, on a plane, or in a, or you know on a bus or anywhere you go, have you seen anybody with a physical magazine lately? Because now digital has taken over. You know, you see everybody with their iPhones and. They're they're looking at stuff like that. No, absolutely, Shamik. I agree with you because the whole wave, the technology has taken over. Technology is the, been the new wave. So you don't necessarily have to do a physical magazine if you want to do do digital online. But people like to see people up close in person. People like to see videos, uh, content. That's the that's the new magazine right there. Content is the new magazine. You, you know, far as seeing visual, people like to see visual stuff. So 
um, when it comes to interviews or whatever the case may be, people love to uh, like there's that's where you're gonna see people. They're gonna see you're gonna see people on their phones, on their digital devices, and stuff like that. So, you know, it's that's that's the way. But no, nah, I'm not necessarily gonna. I might do just one seasonal mag. It all depends. I only when when this whole COVID nineteen thing dies down. When we do some live events, I would like maybe have some publications where people can support, like a donation, whether it's a dollar, three dollars. That that donation goes to what we try and do when we trying to empower uh, people trying to create jobs. We trying to like just do more things where we can give people hope and and bring up their bring up their high self esteem instead of low self esteem. You know, so that's that's my whole mission. That's what I want to do. I want to be able to like, you know, I want to I want to be a change. I want to be of change. You know, so uh, hey Shamika, I got a question for you, Shamika. Um, the voting thing do you do you see that um whoever be getting put in office again whoever gets put in office next month are you looking for are you hoping for any change as far as uh what's going on right now i would I'll definitely love to get your response do you think this voting this this election do you think it's going to be any changes yes or no or you can just 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 comment let me know what you think of that well, anybody that's on right now, it's important. I want to know what the, the viewers, what they think about the election that's coming. Have you been satisfied for like far as what you have been hearing from um, President Donald Trump and, um, you know, Joe Biden? Have you have your guys been feeling kind of feel uh, satisfied or confident in what you heard so far? You know, so. I mean, I just want to, I just, I just feel as though when it comes to the voting, the people that put you in office, they have a right to whatever they asking for. Um, you know, cause the big topic now is reparation. Reparation is the big topic now, tangibles and stuff like that. And everybody have different opinions on all, all this stuff, the reparations and tangibles and stuff like that. I just feel as though, you know, we should never be divided, but it's, I feel as though um, it's important for certain things being put in place because we're lacking in the communities in all 52 states and the inner cities. We are lacking the recreation centers. We need more of that. Really, we need more of that. We need more. We need more people on the, on the ground, you know, um, as far as that mentors um it's just it's just it's so much it is so much that can be can be changed as, as far as what's going on right now but there's a lot of programs that's been taken away and then you know it's important like to get stuff put back in in right place so people can actually have a voice because uh we we is there's a play is a major plague that's going on in the inner cities i mean it could be anywhere but i just feel as though you can really see a change when you have recreations, you have uh, programs put in place for people, for small businesses, entrepreneurs. I don't care if they, they're fashion designers or they're trying to start a business. This should be some way where we have an economic base where, you know, it, it doesn't take, OK, you're going to get denied for a business loan. It should be where we all put our resources and we put our funds together for a young man or woman or older person who want to open up a storefront or a pop-up shop and they need they need some help to help them keep the business going because i really do believe um or oh, i appreciate that boss 3799 um i really i really believe that um i mean it's important to do that cuz you you can see a big change when you start giving people hope people mentalities change when it's a lot of anger and a lot of confusion going on you'll you'll see you'll see a, a a big change you'll see an improvement with in our in our inner cities or in a anywhere you go you know so i think that's that's very important you know so uh i'm boss do you have any um comments on that like what you you uh what do you what do you feel about um first of all you voting and we was we got we a week and a half away uh, from the election, if you're voting or you're not voting, and what's the reason why and why are you voting, and what do you want to see change? You know, 
I, I I know I gave you a whole lot right there, but you know, um, just want to see what you what you feel about that. You know, do you wanna do you, do you feel as though like if I'm if I'm voting, I should be able to like okay, I'm casting my vote. I want to know, you know, why should I vote for you and why, you know, what are you going to do to make the change for the people around me in the community or, or just all different type of issues that people are going through every day. Um, so that's that that's important. You know, one of my sign that trying to see if he's coming on my son, where you at, good brother? Yeah, I haven't, I haven't seen. I'm definitely uh might have to come back because our guest didn't come on yet. So I might have to come back, guys. So stay tuned and we see what happens from here. Thank you so much for tuning in.